I wanted to get into medicine really originally to follow the footsteps of my grandfather. He was a uh, rural uh, family practitioner. Um, my father was an Air Force pilot. Originally I wanted to follow in his footsteps, but he wouldn't let me. So I decided to follow my grandfather's footsteps and go into medicine. And then once I got into medicine, I went into neurosurgery based on my interests. I think practicing medicine in the Tampa Bay area is very uh, rewarding. And it is so because the population changes from year to year. Uh, we have a big influx of people that come in uh, from the north for the winters uh, and a totally different population during the summers. We get to see a variety of different pathologies and uh, in the field of medicine that's rewarding to be able to see different pathologies and treat different types of things that we see. My medical specialty is neurosurgery. Uh, this means the surgical management of uh, brain disorders uh, as well as spinal disorders. I particularly focus on millimeter invasive spine for the treatment of back pain, um, neck pain, and other aspects. What sets me apart from others in my field is that, one, that I'm very compassionate for my patients, uh, and two, I really use surgery as a last option. Uh, I try to treat the patient conservatively as long as I can, and if they do go into the surgical arm and end up needing surgery, uh, we use minimally invasive techniques to be able to address the patient's pathology. The most rewarding part of my job is really seeing the patient after surgery, seeing the outcomes of the surgery, and if the patient has improvement in their, uh, in their pain, for example, uh, that improvement, that, that happy patient is really the most rewarding part of my job. The most challenging part of my job as a neurosurgeon is really delivering bad news. We see patients who are at the end of their life or have disorders that are non-treatable. Delivering that bad news has always been a challenge for me. I don't have any pre-surgical rituals, though on surgical days I do tend to come to work a little bit earlier. I look at all the images for the patients that are having surgery that day. Um, and I don't drink coffee, at least, at least not before surgery. After surgery, I usually have my two cups. Um, outside of work, I enjoy outdoor sports, water sports. Um, my kids really love being on the water, so we tend to do that quite often. Um, most of the time, that's what we do outside of work.